Welcome to Packing for Disney Part 3. It is our carry-ons and personal items. So, let's get packing. I have several pairs of pants and several shirts to go in. Uh, my carry-on just to make sure that even if luggage gets lost, I can change clothes. In the bottom of his bag, I don't know if you can see, but there are two pairs of loafers in there. And I'm wearing wingtips on the plane. Yes, he's got new wingtips that he got for his birthday from mom and dad for the plane. And I'm like Maxwell Smart yesterday. Yes, if you didn't have not seen his birthday video yet, make sure and check that out. He thinks he's Maxwell Smart. A pair of pants that, even if they get a little stuff off the shoes, will not be an issue. And next. Okay, so it's first shoes, then yes, pants. Slacks. Then two shirts. Normally two shirts will go in here. So you're adding a total of three shirts? A total of three. That way I've got a short sleeve and two long sleeves. Okay. We are leaving from the cold Kansas and going to Florida where it's going to be a little bit warmer. What else are you adding to your carry-on? It will get my phone charger, uh, my tablet, and that I think is it because it will also hold a bottle of water in it. Or something like that once we get through security. security okay pick up a newspaper and you're gonna pick up a newspaper and if i pick up a newspaper i think when since we stay at the double tree you actually get I one get the usa today i believe for free yeah Introller. whoa you are like really like blind okay there we go my what do you got roller. your lint roller now and my pajamas like your lint roller and your pajamas are also going your uh yeah carry on now, explain to them how this lint roller works, because it's a little bit different than a typical lint roller. No, it's like a normal lint roller. It's just your normal lint roller kills a tree. <laughs> Mine's eco-friendly. Where can they pick one up if they want an eco-friendly? I got it at Target, mm. but I think Walmart has them, too. It used to be anywhere you went had these instead of the other ones. Okay, so a lint roller and... These are the older style, honestly. So, lint roller and pajamas will also go into your carry-on. Since Sam has showed you what's going into his carry-on, I figured I'd show you what's going into my carry-on and my personal item. First things that's going in is my quart-sized bag of carry-on uh, approved sized items. There's meta there's things like uh, heat rash ointment and a body spray, some face wash, body wash. Um, sunscreen and some extra travel sized cosmetics just so that I can freshen up when we get to our room. Now I'm 99% sure that we have TSA pre-check already through Sam but just in case I'm making sure to put this bag in this pocket over here so that it's easy to get out just in case we don't have TSA pre-check. What's in mine? So starting over here is my bag of TSA approved size toiletries. And this pocket is a Ziploc bag with all of our gift Disney gift cards in it for meals and souvenirs. In the main part of my suitcase, I have, starting over here, in case it's warmer in Orlando than we anticipate, I have a tank top and a pair of shorts. I also have, tucked in beside, a pair of isotoner gloves and a little bag with my uh, permanent markers in it. I have a pair of dress capris. Here in the center, I have Ziploc baggies with my blank wooden ornaments for signatures. I have a pair of jean capris. Over here in the corner, I have two long sleeve t-shirts. Beside them, I have pairs of socks. In here will also be my magic band. It will actually probably be in my um, personal item or I will be wearing it. I will have a pair of mini mouse ears. Again, these could potentially be in my personal item. I will also be putting in a uh, lint roller. Get that in there. And then I'll also have a few more cosmetic items as I get finish up ready for the trip. On top of the other things that are already in my, my um, carry-on bag, I will also have 
five scrunchies. I've got one in my hair, so that's not accounted because I've been wearing that one all the time. I've got a couple Haunted Mansion scrunchies. I have a Toy Story Land and a Hidden Mickey scrunchie. And then I have an Aristocats and a Disney Disney snack scrunchie that I purchased from Cargo 619 Sew a Break Magic. First of all, item bag will be this Minnie Mouse bag that I got at the Disney outlet in Oklahoma City for my birthday. It's pretty well just a tote bag. It's got one zipper pocket there, but other than that, it is just an empty tote you know what's going on in our carry-ons let me tell you what's going into my personal bag in my personal bag will be my tablet I have my tablet Sam will have his tablet so that he can watch a movie or read a book there will also be our portable chargers this is one of them I've got another one that looks like this and I've got a fast charging Max box by Samsung. It will have um, our cords in it. And it will also potentially have a regular book for me to read. But I do have a lot of books both on my tablet and here on my phone. So my personal item is pretty simple. I don't want it to be overly heavy. And I still want it to have plenty of room to be underneath the seat in front of me. That's it for packing for Disney Part 3. We've got our... Um, check-ins all ready to go. We've got our carry-ons ready to go. <sighs> By the time you're seeing this video, we'll be on vacation. So, you know what? We'll see you definitely in the theme parks. Bye! Bye.